going on guys darby here from gen ai university and today we're going to fuck around and find out with loom's new ai tool which you can see here on my screen loom just launched um ai to now available for everyone something like five bucks per creator on the plan so um extremely affordable and really cool so i'll show you how i've been using it to edit this video um uh, one um their their title transcription sort of thing is, is really on point um, and just needs a little slight editing here and there. One thing I really like is the summary and the chapters as generated by Loom AI. So in the chapters, you can go and zoom these different sections. So refining a recipe, creating micro content, unations, different stages of this recipe. It'll jump you back and forth to them and show you, uh, of course, you can start to generate the content from there. Now, one other thing I think is really handy with this tool in particular is the 25 or the filler words being removed and the seconds of silence just to save everyone time and a lot of unnecessary ums and ahs and that sort of thing. Um, so some of the bigger features when it comes to the Loom AI, and I really do like the chapters and the summary because it just makes it that much easier and you don't need to go and now run a transcript through uh, like ChatGPT and ask it to like write you a summary. It's just done right here with Loom's AI built into it. So you don't even have to leave Loom for that editing um, side of things. And then also the ability inside of Loom, which I like is um, one of the capabilities is being able to add uh, buttons with buttons and text. So you could add call to actions or link specific links um, at uh, specific parts of a video, which is always handy. And so the trimming is really easy uh, to edit videos. So let's just say if I wanted to edit out uh, a few minute portion where I'm just running and giving an example, uh, see here, if I move my head, you can split the video. I can go back, split the video, and then just simply backspace and delete a certain section. You can also insert videos and add clips here. So if I have a clip in my Loom library and I say, I want to add this clip over here, I would just add that clip in and then edit the video accordingly. Well, right now, if I say I didn't want to add a video or I didn't want to edit that clip out, all I would do is I would just control Z or simply undo that split and it's going to put everything back in its rightful place. And then I can also go back, revert to the original or cancel things out if I uh, you know, made a mistake or just wanted to back out of the progress I had made. All in all, super easy, even easier now than it was before to film short, quick instructional videos, demonstrations, you know, any, any kind of video really inside of Loom. And then you can seamlessly add in additional clips and edit your videos there as well as the chapters and the summary out of those videos, removing the filler words and the silence, super handy. Then one other key thing here was the suggestions that I forgot to mention. You can add these tasks that Loom is automatically doing in here. As you can see, you see some comments, but I added a, a task in, and let's just say uh, 20 minute mark right, blog post with more insights. If someone were to um, be going through here and doing this as a work along, you, I could add these tasks in to different sections of the video so that people knew that there was something that they were a specific process. So especially for like instructional videos and tutorials where we want to do hand on, like hands-on exercises inside of a video, I think it's a really cool with Loom AI. Now it's all inside of the Loom platform and gives you a lot of powerful, simple to use tools at your disposal. So check it out. Go to geniuniversity.com slash Loom to get started with Loom. If you don't have an account already, it's just a minute to get signed up and get ready. And I'd recommend adding their Chrome extension um, browser on so you can just uh, video anytime you're in your browser, have the desktop app as well that you can use and uh, videos, start using it with Loom and uh, to create. So hope you find that helpful and go ahead and subscribe to Gen AI University on our YouTube channel as well for more videos like this. Until next time, keep calm and AI on.